Hey guys, it is Flybox here, and today we're taking a look at why Core fails to beat Roblox. But before we dive right in today's video, I do want well, you know we're going to be doing a shoutout giveaway at the very end of each and every month. And if you want to be entered into it, all you got to do is smash that like button and subscribe button. Comment down below, I subscribe to be entered into it. And don't forget about the bell icon as well, so you don't miss on any future videos. Anyways guys, let's go ahead and jump right in today's video. So if you're like me who didn't really know what Core was up until like a month ago, pretty much Core is the idea of Roblox. Essentially it is a game like Roblox where you can create and make your very own games on a platform. Just think of it in a more higher graphics, better graphics overall, the lighting, everything is just less blocky and more realistic. So it's definitely a step up in the graphics department, but everything else just tends to relatively be just Roblox. Although it has some unique ideas to it, majority of it, it's pretty much what it wants to be is Roblox. And this was created by Epic Games. Now, if you don't know what Epic Games is, they are the creator of Fortnite. Fortnite is a massive phenomenon throughout the gaming history, just like Minecraft and many others. And this was their idea of making their very own version of Roblox to see if they could do it, to see if they can make a really cool idea of Roblox and try to get their fair share of that money of the idea of Roblox, to make their own metaverse in their own field. And they really did a very good job on it. I mean, the graphics are great, the games are good and it's a lot of fun there's not too many bugs in it as well and they did really really well with the interface of the game and the website overall it's just really good they knew what they were doing but the problem is Roblox has been around since 2004 and this has only been around for a year or two now even though they've threw money at a ton of youtubers to go ahead and make some sponsors to show off their game they definitely have a strong player base a lot of people from Roblox and a lot of people from the epic game that played Fortnite have moved over to this and all the people that have seen it through advertisements have come to it and really enjoyed it but it lacks originality it lacks content that makes it good Whenever you take a look at it, I mean, it's just bare bones. They took things from Fortnite and they took things from Roblox and just merged into one. They've made it where there's like a shop where you can go and get all kinds of cool little cosmetics for your character to customize your person and avatar in game. And then there's just pretty much you load up games just like you do on Roblox. And the other thing is there's no original games on Core. There's not a whole lot of games that are just solely created by creators on this game. They pretty much went gun ho for trying to get as many people on their site. Whereas Roblox has been around for so long, organically so many people have just fell in love with it and have continued to grow off of it. It's a very stable platform with a currency inside the game that entices creators and game developers to come to their site to actually make games because it's profitable. Whereas Core doesn't have that economic stability in the game and therefore there's just not a whole lot to it. On top of that, they've taken games from Roblox, they've taken ideas from many other places. Now there's nothing really wrong with that because I mean Roblox has done the same, but again the thing is there's no originality to it, there's no original games. Now I could be completely wrong but from what I saw I didn't see any, and honestly it's just really the reasons why it fails to be better than Roblox. Now this could change in the future and there could be some updates, but the only thing I could really see going for core is just the graphical side of things where it's definitely a lot better in that department. But the one thing that Roblox has is that graphic field. The graphics to Roblox are original and definitely stand out because it is blocky in that aspect of just nostalgia feel. It, that's why it pops more than just this realism. I think the one thing is whenever you have more of a cartoony game or something that kind of is a little jagged, it always sticks versus something that's more realism because we always live in the day to day. Something that's not realism makes us want to look at it more. But this is our video on why Core fails to be better than Roblox. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section down below. And if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe button and we'll see you guys in another amazing video. Bye bye guys.